Good morning, folks. There's never much in the way of science news on Thanksgiving, so the Solar Wind and our other channel decided to make up for that. Hopefully you'll join us live this afternoon, but right now we're at spaceweathernews.com. We're finding the last 24 hours on our star were relatively quiet until a filament snapped up north. Small one, no real ejecta out of it. But of course, within 24 hours, the coronal hole stream will arrive and amplify the solar wind plasma speed. About one day later, a small CME from the southern filament eruption will arrive. Low-level geomagnetic storms are expected. And while it unfolds, we're going to need to watch these sneaky little sunspots on the disk, growing, starting to raise the X-ray flux, but so far benign magnetic complexity. Eyes on their development today. Sharing the MODIS orbit drift and capabilities video recently posted to Goddard SVS, it shows the importance of high cadence observations and looking with more than one eye, able to spot subtle chemical changes while detailing vast macro scale shifts as well. An interesting story of note in the cosmic lithium conundrum, they found a brown dwarf pair where one has incredibly preserved its lithium abundance. It's the oldest and coldest place they've seen the spectral returns like this. It's B that has the lithium stores, A appears to have completely destroyed all it had. Big Burb Channel the Disaster Vehicle, Episode 1, comes out at 4 p.m. Eastern Time today. That's 1 p.m. Pacific. It's a premiere, and both Rocky and I plan to be live in the chat section. Hope to see you there this afternoon. Get him. Get him. How's the lighting? This looks good. All right, ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, as a moment from our yesterday plays out here, I want to say that I read and appreciate all the thanks you give every day. But you know who really sacrifices? This angel. And the little angels who depend on us. They are the ones whose entire lives work around the morning show and the weekend podcast, whose nights are sacrificed for the early morn, and whose attempts to enjoy this world while we can have been stagnated by this mission and its steadfast consistency. Folks, I've been so selfish in the pride of my never missing a day and a deadline. My family, our future, and the ranch are priority. I have no idea exactly how things are going to change, but they have to. The timing of the daily show, actually taking days off on occasion. My children are getting older, their bedtime stretch. My wife and I sacrifice for them, but really, we have given up nearly all of our own lives for this morning show. They sacrifice for us. For me, it's my turn. We greatly appreciate your support. Folks, get over to Big Burb at 4 p.m. Eastern. Both Rocky and I do plan to be there once again. We've got wind maps and shots of our star to close. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.